Sevens rugby is completely fierce. To be a Sevens player, you need to be strong, super fit, agile, and you need to be able to whip that ball left or right. Setting up Green Gazelle's Rope Club has been fantastic, and it's breaking down that stigma associated with players or athletes who follow a plant-based diet. My whole life is based around rugby. I started playing rugby when I was about six years old uh, at Salisbury Rugby Club. I just remember the mud. Like, half of the training was just throwing mud at each other from my boots. <laughs> 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 Big mud balls. Just flicking yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, remember yeah, that, yeah. Huh? Brendan was always passionate about rugby, wasn't he? He's, you know, yeah, most yeah. of the time. Most when of he time. wasn't losing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're doing well on that Green Gazelles team, aren't you? You put a lot of effort into that. Yeah, it's taken a... It's yeah, doing amazing, isn't it? Yeah, we're getting there. We've got, like, 60-odd um, players now yeah. uh, from all over the world. It's amazing how you've organised it all. My partner had a herniated disc and we had to adopt a plant-based diet to cure her injury. We gave it a go for a week. We were completely energised. I'm very performance driven. Now uh, I could train more and recover quicker. I lost weight. I didn't feel as tired. I felt stronger. I could lift more from just eating more vitamins and minerals. I wanted to mirror that on the rugby field and just came up with a crazy idea that let's create the very first vegan rugby club. It's an exciting time. I'm super pumped to get on the pitch. And people are going to take notice. They're going to be like, who are we? One, two, three, Gazelles! Yes, team, let's go! The other teams are probably going to expect that we're going to be really weak, brittle, tiny people. Actually, they'll probably be quite shocked because a lot of our players are monsters. <laughs> so one of the biggest parts of rugby I love is the team spirit. Ball's coming in. No. Yeah. Ball's there, ball's there. Ow, ow, ow! Out, out, out. Let's go, let's play. Everyone looks after each other. Cheers, mate. Uh, it's just a family, you know? Your rugby team is your family. Meal time afterwards is like, you know, you get all of the players in. You know, we've all done a good training session. You get together, have a bit of banter with the guys. You can uh, enjoy some decent food. Beautiful vegan Wellington. Oh, here we go, lads. Here we go. Dinner is served. I hope you enjoy it. it smells great. Mm. Beautiful. Hello. 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 Make a... I don't know about you guys, but like half the stuff on this on this table, I probably wouldn't have bothered to make. Like me was the centre of the plate, mm -hmm. and so like I was quite a lazy cook. Your yeah. kitchen is definitely yeah. more colourful now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I went yeah. through aisles yeah. in the supermarket that yeah. I wouldn't yeah. even walk yeah. down. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. For me, it was uh, a joy to you know have a look at all these extra ingredients that are uh, available to me. When I first went yeah. plant based, I kind of naively thought I'm probably going to waste away and I'll probably be unhealthy and yeah. protein yeah. deficiency. Yeah. Now I currently weigh the biggest, most I've ever weighed at 121 kilos. Yeah. Wow. Benefits be massive in terms of health and digestion and energy levels. So there's no limiting factors to it in my eyes. We've really got a bit of fire in our stomach now, and I really genuinely believe this club is going somewhere. I think it's amazing that Brendan has brought us all together from all different backgrounds. We're, we're set with the same vision and same direction of where we wanted the Green Gazelles to go. We're going to hit the tournaments and I want to showcase Green Gazelles as all players following a plant-based diet, a success story. Yeah.